Once upon a time, there was a trend engine named Toby. He loved his new job on the Honda Soda. And a faithful friend, Henrietta, loved it. Suddenly, Toby saw the, 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 little, the little puppy barking in the distance. <coughs> hey there, boy, said Toby. Do you want to play ball? Said Toby. Do you want to build a snowman? Do you want to build a snowman? Asked Toby. <coughs> he barked. Yes. What is your name? What's your name? D said to Hey, Worcester, I just thought of something. You can be a super eater too. I can? Nice. What a wonderific idea. What do you think, Worcester? Do you want to be a super eater with us? Woof, woof, woof. What's your name? Asked Tiny, asked Toby. I'm Wolfster with dictionary power. Said, said Toby. Said the super dog. I can tell you what any word means. Her then J. Then James arrived. He was me so menacing. What does menacing mean? Asked Toby. Asked to asked 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 Toby. Asked Toby. Sing mean. Asked Toby. Wolfster, do the rescue. Said said Wolfster. <laughs> My doggy dictionary, I can tell you what any word means. Menacing means angry. Me Ugh. Menacing. Now we know what it means. What do you do? Give your tail a wag. He loves to, Worcester loves to wag his tail. And James arrived. He was very rude. Yuck! Ugh! What dirty object, he would say. At last, Obi lost patience. James, he asked, why are you red? I'm a splendid engine, answered James, ready for anything. You may see my paint dirty. What's that thing? He asked. Oh, said Toby irritably. That's why you want needed bootlaces. She'll be ready, I suppose, said Toby. What's that thing? What's that thing? asked James. That's my new f that is my new friend. Give your tail a wag. What's the wag his tail? What's that thing? asked James. Hmm. Oh, it's it's only Wolfster," said James. He's a brave little super dog. He has a dictionary power. James went redder than ever and snorted off. It's uh, it's such a little thrill. The boot they have in you should be the men to hold in this coaches. At the end of the line. James left his coaches and got ready for his next train. It was a slow freight, stopping in every station to pick up and set down freight cars. James hated slow freight trains. Dirty cars with dirty sidings, he grumbled. Ugh! And starting with only a few, he picked up more and more cars in this station, so he had a long train. At 
At first, the freight cars behaved well, but James bumped them so crossly for Baby Victoria to get back at him. Presently, he approached the top of Gordon's Hill. Every friction to pin hold to sit down their wakes. James had had an accident with freight cars before, so should I remember this? Wait, James, wait, said the driver. But James wouldn't wait. You were just... You were so big you wanted to save the trouble your wolf to wouldn't be next net. The car's chance had come. Hooray! Hooray! He laughed. And banging the buff just there pushed him down the hill. On! 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 Laughed the freight cars. I got to stop! I got to stop! Groan James. Through the session they thunder, this dexter lay ahead. Crash! Something sticky splashed all over James. He had run into two tar wagons and was black from snow cost to cab. He was more dirty than hurt. But the tar wagons and some cars were all to pieces. Toby, Wolfster, and Percy sent to help, and came as quickly as they could. Wolfster wagged his tail. Wolfster wagged his tail. Wolfster wagged his tail. It saw James a mess. Look here, Percy! exclaimed Toby. Whatever is that dirty object? That's James, didn't you know? It changed its shape, said Toby. But James is a splendid red engine. And you never see his paint dirty. James pretended he hadn't heard. Toby, Wolfter, and Percy cleared away behind the fake cars and helped James home. So Tom at met them. Well done, Percy, Wolfster, and Toby. He turned to James. Fancy one of your fake cars ran away. I am surprised. You're not fit to be seen. You must be clean at once. Toby should have a new coat of paint. Please, sir, get Henry on get Henry on hat one too, said Toby. Certainly, Toby. Oh, why don't you go ask go ask the Wolfster? He can help too. He can have the coat of paint too. Puppy ask puppy. I mean Wolfster. Do you wanna play ball? He has one too. Worcester, can you have one too? asked Toby. Yes. Said he barked, barked Worcester. It began to wag his tail. Now we know what it means. And, and all James could do is watch Toby and Pers Wolf doing Percy, and he came out happily with the news. And they all lived happily ever after. Everybody, that is, except James. The end. A Walt Disney production.